Sure. I mean, ultimately, I think, you know, um, as I mentioned, it is a journey and it's something that needs to be planned for. Um, and from a learning and development, um, you know, perspective, it is about, you know, taking into consideration the types of content, the way it's delivered. Things have changed in a year dramatically on the learning front. There's different types of, of tools out there. I mean, if you looked at uh, 2020, um, immersive technology and AR and VR and social were at the bottom of the list. They are now at the top. Um, and a lot of it has to do with, you know, the product of what we're doing. And so I think it's about, you know, planning for the journey, but it's also thinking outside of the box, tasking your organization to not just think about a training class that's delivered in person or something that's delivered virtual or content at you, but explore all those options social look at new tools think about you know immersive technology because today is different than it was you know you know 12 months ago and i think it's going to continue to change